Holstein Association USA believes in continued improvement generation after generation. As high performing as the Holstein cow is today, there are ways to make the world's perfect cow even more profitable. In fact, Holstein leaders are willing to bank on people who want to make it happen. Dr. Chad Deckow is one of them. His research is on making cattle more feed efficient. So there's been in the last two years a lot of focus on selecting for feed efficiency. And that makes sense because feed is 50 to 60 percent of a dairy producer's cost. So if we can reduce that cost and become economically more efficient, that's great, right? It all begins with the first step. Ten years from now, how we select for feed efficiency will look a little bit different than it does now. So, but we had to get the process started. Researchers see an issue, determine that it can be improved, then tackle it head on. Like Dr. Anna Denical, who's studying environmental adaptability and heat stress. Heat stress is, is a problem, right? It affects the productivity of the dairy. It has a huge economic impact. So anything that we can try to do to decrease those effects. And I was just talking to some colleagues just now this is not a magic bullet because there isn't one, right? We need to try to build tools that together will create a solution. And I think this really is a step on the right direction. The research process on paper looks pretty straightforward. In practice, it often gets complex, like the research Dr. J.P. Martins is doing into milk production and fertility. Cows that had high milk, higher milk production, uh, they had more double ovulations, even though they were treated with double of zinc, which is a fertility treatment that increases progesterone. As I've shown, these programs are really highly effective on increasing progesterone during the growth of the follicle for time day eye and increasing fertility of lactate in dairy cows. Those are only three examples of many research projects that are currently improving the Holstein breed. Another round of research applications are sought by August 15th from principal investigators at U.S. universities and nonprofits. Of course, we get funds so we can do the research, right? Um, I think it's really uh, amazing that the Holstein Association USA has this grant program uh, and really helps. Holstein Association USA's grant program is all in the name of improvement for a cause. I'm able to do applied research that I think could be applied directly in the field to help improve breeders' herds directly. For Holstein Association USA, I'm Bob Cervera.